Hey guys, Shannon here, and welcome back to Pokemon Expert Emerald. Sorry if you can hear any background noise, it is quite hot in the UK and I've got my fan running, I hope it doesn't interfere with it too much. Without further ado, let's get into this. And um, before we get completely started, I just want to ask if you enjoy the content at all, please feel free to hit that subscribe button, like button, leave a comment, all that good stuff, share it with friends. And... Little info about today's episode is the fact that I have no idea where we're going. I know, well, I have a rough idea where we've got to go. Leave me alone! Why does everyone ring me every single time I start? I literally, every single time I hit that record button, someone rings like, Hi, how are you? No, I don't want to know. Go away. Let's see whether this is anything to do with the hideout. Is this the topless? Wait, hang on. You're telling me that not only did I not get into any trainer battles on the way down here, I also got this first go. What? I promise, I have. I, I genuinely was worry, like, worry about this because I, I didn't know how long this would take and this is my first recording. I have no funny business, no editing. I genuinely just found my way instantly. <laughs> Seafloor cavern, I wonder what... We've got in here for uh, encounters. Is there any encounters in here? There is. We have a level 30 Zuba. Nah. We need Rock Smash. I don't have my small axe strength. I'll be right back. And we're back. I dumped Tyranitar in the um, Tyrant in the box to go and get a uh, small axe so that we could make our way through here. We are a little bit underpowered compared to what we could be, however, I do want to explore the space, I want to get everything done. Level 71! Oh, Icy Wind sucks. Ice Beam nearly kills. However, Leech Seed shall do us. Good, and I can use a level 71. Sorry, guys, that's taking me by surprise. That's a little much. Crit! This isn't good. Oh, my lord. I outspeed for sure. Still. We knock it out. Jolteon? Earthquake would be nice. Earthquake would be really nice right now. Strength should be fine. After it was a cool and um, strength again, we should kill maybe as long as that wasn't a high roll. It was a high roll. Uh, I guess some rollouts going. Go to sleep, we get leftovers. Please don't miss rollouts. We could use this stacking for the next Pokemon. Decent impacts. Down goes. Hopefully, this should Oko. Just what? Just Oko for no reason. Like, easy. Flamethrower, I think it's Fig Fat, so we're good. Rollout does hit. Do we Oko in one? It's gonna be close. It does. Oh yeah, get down. Chonk is a beast. I'm so nervous. Like that, that is not good. I can't believe Ted went down already. Do we have any revives? We've got to have a revive, right? Max revive. Probably rather keep that for uh, the Elite Four, but what can you do? Scary being 10 levels down. It's really scary being 10 levels down. Nido King. You see, Earthquake's gonna suck. As long as we don't get crit, we should live another one and be able to grow. Don't crit. Thank you. Get a little bit back. Now Giga Drain should grab enough. Did we not have speed? My bad. I, I thought we were out of bad. That was completely my bad. Psychic 
Should Oko from after the each seed? Yeah, I believe it will. Yeah, it does. <sighs> Genuine under pressure. It's level 71, really stubbornly by me, like, no, I won't grind. I am scared that this thing. If I don't hit this, Gardevoir could get taken down. We hit it. Oh. Thank you, game. And then two psychic should kill. It is bulky as hell, but two psychic should. Holy. That instant wake up, though. Special defense goes down, full restore again, but it doesn't matter, this one kills because of the defense down. Let's <sighs> get all the XP we can. Because we need it. We are so entirely under leveled. Okay, not a terrible lead. Yeah, Frog Smash to deal with Mighty Ender slowly but surely. Can I get one D down set without dying? Probably. Not that it's going to help all that much. So Fang Hurts. Uh, here goes my... Unless this actually... Hmm. Screw it, let's go. Can you throw? Do it. No, not enough. There goes my... Uh... Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye, Frog <laughs> <laughs> I am playing this so badly right now. Oh, why did I... Just, just... Go to sleep. <laughs> Please hit. Fun. Fame for that. Please go to sleep, Mighty Anna. Please, for the love of God, go to sleep, Mighty Anna. At least I outspeed most things because of the... We now can Psychic that and Fame for that. Oh, cow. Comes into a psychic, for helping will not go down its tank. Ooh, it does! It does indeed go down. Thieves my Charizard, which means it's an idiot. It could have gone for the super effective attack on my uh, Gardevoir, but uh, obviously be good. Neither is not resisted, neither is outrage. Let's just outrage it. <laughs> I'm now locked into outrage though, so. And it runs off physical attack, so hopefully that, uh... Yeah, easily. With two on one, this is just gonna go down. So that's level 61, which is good. We need all the levels we can get right now, Jesus. I can't believe they're 70 plus, that's insanity! Too weird. Let's get on with this. Let's go ruin ourselves. <sighs> don't think we can do much. Please don't crit. We fly we're faster. This is not very effective though, isn't it? Because I feel on a super Hmm Fly was super effective. Does that mean it's a fighting type or a grass type? Um It's fighting type! I wonder if it did so much more damage. So Delix is normally a pain in the backside, but its physical defense is really high, its special isn't, so. Though that wasn't very effective. Shadow Ball? Also not very effective? Yeah, even less. Thought so. Let's just psychic it. And special defense to drop. Yep, that ends it. We good. <sighs> we win another battle. We are now down to three Pokemon now. Well, continue on through for now. Straight into another battle. Let's see whether our last three Pokemon can pass. This isn't good. I mean, go for the attack boost. I genuinely think that the Rachel is probably more of the threat. Double team, face finesse, and missed. Of course it missed. And now we have Spore. Please just hit. Yep, that's gonna suck, but not as much as Parasex. Uh, both type attacks would. Sea King, okay. If I can wake up, I can Thunderbolt that. 
course I'm fast asleep, so bomb hurts. We're going to heal after this move as long as ticking doesn't double up. It's not. Meteor Mash again. We're just basically going for the attack boost chance, really. And we heal up Lucy. Ice Beam isn't going to do too much. Giga Drain sucks, but isn't too bad. Idiot is paralyzed. We Thunderbolt the Seeking. Hydro Pump's going to hurt, but not too badly. We wake up, which is good. Sludge Bomb really hurts. Oh, why? Meteor Mash misses. And we get seriously. Honestly, we're going to play this better when we get back in here, but we really don't have the team to be dealing with this right now. We have like half of our team left. And we are severely underleveled. Man, to keep us underleveled, but actually, you know, make an effort to. Say we just roll out and hope for the best. We find the bolt seeking again. We hit that. We absolutely do, definitely do hit that. Seeking his attack missed, thankfully. <laughs> Be drill. Sludge Bomb's gonna hurt again. Roll up. He's gonna start on its rampage. Uh, I'd probably go down here, but. Oh, he outspeeds! Roll up, missed. Mega Horn. It's gonna suck. Spore sleep. Yeah. We are going to lose this one, and we'll be right back. Wait it out. Back to the purple center. One, let's remember the revives. Two, I need to sort some other stuff out. So I'll be right back. And we're back with a slight team change around. Let's see what we can do this now. Project Raichu. Snorlax should live an earthquake. And we can upgrade them both. We're going to yawn that. Earthquake hits them. Um. Did Raichu avoid the attack? And did... Hang on! Let's rock slide them. And let's roll out you. Fast sleep, Giga Drain, that's gonna suck. I mean, I could just storm them out by healing, but I really don't want to. Seriously, I might have to grind up a little bit. Like, this is so much. Clever. Using my own attack against me, really. It's actually really clever, I must admit. We're going to gamble on Snorlax waking up and rock sliding actually working, and we're going to quickly energy root the Snorlax. Yay! I'm still asleep. <sighs> Trying not to get frustrated. Thank you for actually hitting through. So that's on rages. Okay, we've got a chance to heal our poor Tyrannosaur. We can only heal with Tyrannosaur because uh, Chonk is locked in, however it probably works. Volt Tackle does nothing. Should do nothing, doesn't do nothing. Tyrant goes almost down once again. Let's just gonna start confusion. Oh my god, I'm so lucky. I am so annoyed. My, this turn, guaranteed, Tyrannosaur will wake up. How many turns of confusion has it been? And how many turns of sleep has it been? I'm just gonna sit here and bolt myself up if you're just gonna keep doing that. Before restore, we at least get rid of one of those. Super effective crit, maybe? I don't know how the hell. I mean, it's super effective, granted, but still, the hell game. Now, can I please just get a succession of rollouts done? Do good rain. Thank you, out of confusion. And I guarantee it confuses me again in a minute. Chunk gets hit once. 
actually going to switch out because it's guaranteed going to go for another what? <sighs> well, Tackle shouldn't do much, all that much. Still a hell of a lot. We get dragon again. Shouldn't do much. I don't know. We can live that. Which is going to concentrate on the rollout. Rollout is going to save us. It's not going to miss. Chonk is not going to get confused. And we are going to hit the target and we're going to knock it the hell out. And I'm going to keep rolling through it. There's the Spora gone. There's the Sleeper gone. Thank you. Is it Bug Flying or Bug Poison? It's Bug Poison, isn't it? So, theoretically, Chonk should now just Oko it. Right? And what into Idiom again. It's going to do it half. Mega Horn misses, which is nice, because otherwise that probably would have killed. Rollout should Oko. It does. What's scary is this isn't even Archie. This will be not very effective. Trunk needs to switch targets. Trunk really needs to switch targets. Nidium needs to wake the hell up. This is going to do a lot even though it's not very effective. Okay, it still kills and it isn't not very effective. But that might be immune. Please, for the love of God, he didn't wake the hell up. Why did I roll out that guy? I'm an idiot. It's going to miss. I suppose you just try and stall using this. Roll out does hit. It's a rock type move, not a ground type move. I'm an idiot. As long as I hit, I think this kills. It does not kill because I do not. Oh yeah, but I'm right choose now like plus god knows what evasion. Okay then. I suppose we can just slow our defense while we wait. That's gonna do a lot of damage to me, but it'll also do a lot of damage back to him. Switch out to Tyrant. And we heal. This does a lot of damage. It actually kills, thank you. might be okay here. We might actually win this. Honestly, at the cost of a million different potions. Fake out. I didn't actually attack, so a good Vault Tackle is going to do more damage to him than me, which is good. Roller hits again. Does not quite okay the potion, but the Sandstorm does. Oh, my lord. This is difficult. This is literally difficult. If he Vault Tackles again, he basically almost KOs himself and then we miss because yeah accuracy hacks although Chonk has been an MVP with that rollout today like only having that extra damage is the only reason that I can Do I have any more accurate moves Just earthquake and then Straight up strength. Earthquake hits me. Right to avoid this attack, obviously. We just gotta pray for a hit at this point. Like, one of our hits has to hit. Rock Slide does all the damage, and the Sandstorm takes it down. Back into another puzzle. Like a pro. Easy. Oh, go away, Zubat! I am literally level 64. Why do I have to encounter level 29 for Zubat? Why is the enemy level 71? Yet the Zubat is level. Never mind. Ooh. Ooh. Temp for Earthquake. I forgot that was here. Or did they move it? It might not have actually been here. 
See, all, a lot of these could use the coverage. Let's go as clutch out paralysis. Roll that has saved me. Strength as Tamiorn is useful. Yon hasn't been half as useful, so I like it to be Earthquake, and I think I'm going to turn it to teach to this guy as well, because he actually could use it. We're going to stop learning using growth for setup moves, and we're going to have Earthquake just to cover any fire types that we may bump into. Oh, or electric types, we could wall it using the grass type against the electric type, and... Actually, hold it right there. Here we go. Actual boss battle. That was only an admin. Archie, so this is, it was you after all. Archie, behold. See how beautiful it is. The sleeping form of ancient Pokemon Kyogre. I have waited long for this day to come. It surprises me how you've managed to chase me here. But that's all over now. For the re realization of my dream, you must disappear now. Seriously though, this is this this is definitely a sheesh moment. They're gonna bat me. He's gonna trash me. That is not a good lead. That is really not a good lead. What am I doing? What am I doing? Go flinch, flinch, flinch. Oh, yeah, I'm done. I meant to switch Pokemon. I did not mean to do that. At least we get a clean switch in now, so. I don't have my Gardevoir. Gardevoir would be good for, good for this. I dropped Gardevoir because it was getting absolutely railed in the last one. Psychic does the majority. High jump kick's going to hurt, but not too bad. Thank you. Should have missed, to be honest. Let's face it. Full restore. We'll take that. We'll Psychic again. And we'll Psychic for a third time. Metagross takes the Psychic and get just absolutely eats it. Pursue. Oh, Earthquake. Trolled me. Chonk. You can earthquake him back, right? <laughs> and defense, that's really annoying. He's basically just setting up his defense at this point. How the hell am I supposed to do this level? How did he get the attack boost? I have a feeling this heal is going to mean nothing, honestly. Like, there is no way in hell this is going to save me. Not with that boost. I can't outspeed. If he gets another boost, it is completely over. That's a crit. And that's not even a crit. I don't outspeed. Zard might outspeed and be able to flame for a kill, but we are screwed for the rest of the team. Does it kill? There's a question mark. Yeah, special defense isn't raised. So he has physical defense raising moves. So keep that in mind. Don Fan will go to Ted. And we Giga Drain. And hope for the best. Hope for a two hit. It is just a two hit. Earthquake is probably going to go with that level difference. No, it doesn't. We outspeed. We take the rest, but a little bit. Earthquake. It survived on- oh no, the sandstorm! We survived on 2 HP as well! Well, I have a feeling we still outspeed, at least. So, we can... Just flamethrower and finish that one off. Okay, it didn't even... Focus band. Actually had a focus band one. Should have gone on a squirt. And again, it wouldn't have mattered, they'd have got heave away because... Focus band. Now we've got to hope we can surf everything. It's not going to happen. Intimidates my attack, which is amazing. Although surf is special. So fake out is annoying. For restore, surf will not do half. And this is it. That's it over. He hits and kills unless he misses a jump kick. Like he genuinely hits unless he misses. There we go. That might be an MVP play. Didn't think about that one. We can avoid the thing by diving and then finish it off. 
Tentacruel, however, we like, like, there's no way. We do not. We just don't. Cut is our best option, which is not brilliant, as you can see. See how much this does. If we get take under half, we might be okay. Misses. Take a little bit of damage, take a little bit of damage. Uh, dive. Hydro Pump sucks. But we're good. Hydro Pump misses again. Dive does nothing. Cut does nothing, dive does nothing, surf does probably nothing as well. Yep, although we weren't poisoned, so we are okay. We can heal again. Speed rose sharply, which is fine, because I wasn't out speeding it anyway. Full restore. Irritating. I really don't know how we're going to do this. We need, we got to pray for a crit, basically. We have literally got to pray for a crit. Unless, actually, what if we rock smash, which is not very effective, we try and get the defense drop. Yeah, that's it. Actually, no, we can antidote, we can antidote and survive a hit. Yep, yeah, poison hurts, but we are going to antidote that, because no, not at all. Attack misses, that's pretty damn MVP. We're down to our last Pokemon and we are literally fighting for our lives. We didn't get the defense drop. We heal again. Wait, we have revives. What am I doing? What the hell am I doing? We have revives. Honestly? It's effective in two ways. Flesh bomb sucks. Take it there, take it there. We heal Squirt once more just to be safe. Or do we let it go down and go straight into the Venusaur? But we don't know what's coming out next, so... And he has been really tanky because he's resistant to most of their moves. So I've got MVP and I've made him into a uh, TM user. Switch bomb hurts, but we're good. Okay, Hydro Pump is down. We know for a fact he's going to use another Sludge Bomb as long as it doesn't crit. We take take it. We go for the... No, we don't outspeed anymore, do we? Because he got the speed raise and I don't think we outspeed anymore. I was just going to attack that and that might have dropped me straight away instantly. There we go. And just to see where we... Yep, he outspeeds. Toxic inbound. He hits me with Toxic. I don't know what's coming out next, but we're going to get this clean switch in either way. We could use a nice type of a rock type for this. I think we're going to let Squirt go down and we're going to reheal. Um, yeah, we're going to revive the Tyranitar. Tyrant, you are needed. Oh god, not double team. Why? Do I need full restores? Or just full heals? Do we need four restores and restores? We do not. So we energy root first, then we heal poison. Fudge bomb, that's stab. Yeah, there's no way we're living that. So let's just use this turn to finish healing up Tyrant. We go down to Aerial Ace. Fingers Rock Slide is not the most accurate move in the first place. So it's 50-50 it's chance, really, whether it's going to hit in the first place without. But we hope. What we do is we hope. We do hit, we do land, we do Oko. One more Pokemon left. Sharpedo. Honestly, very 50-50 whether we survive this or not. Ancient power, Hydro Pump kills. 100% Hydro Pump kills. I, I knew, I almost saw that coming. Speed boost, which is annoying. Leech Seed. We've got double DP, we've got double like, uh, please don't crit. We just wear it down. Special defense falls. That is not good. We need to switch out and switch back in. We need something to just eat up hits. And there's only one person I know that can eat up his hits off of these guys. Crunch will kill because of the drop. 
chunk comes out. And we just let it wear away at itself. Honestly, we literally just sit here with leftovers, with heals, and we literally just make the most of this. I'm actually 20 levels down, pretty much. Now, as long as we don't get hit by another defense drop, in which case we just literally... As long as we get, don't get another defense drop, we win, basically. No matter what he does, because Strength will let me get that off. We then, because he heals, get the heal back and the leftovers, which is always nice. Let's try and go for it. Ooh, that's going to hurt. Body slam, and it all goes. Right, finishes it off. Oh my god, this has been difficult. Foo foo foo. I command you, I must recognize that you are truly gifted, but I have for this in my possession. With the red orb, I can make Kyogre. The red orb suddenly began shining by itself. Dude, can you not color match? Surely it be the blue. Actually, what? I didn't do anything. Where did the red orb. Where did Kyogre go? Hmm. This message from members outside. Yes, what is it? It's raining heavily. Good. That should have happened. That was why we awakened Kyogre. To realize Team Aqua's vision of expanding the sea. What? It's raining far harder than we envisioned? You're in danger? That can't be. Just That's just not, not possible. Hold your position and monitor the situation. There's something wrong. The Red Orb is supposed to awaken and control Kyogre, but why? Why did Kyogre disappear? Why? Maxi, what have you bit? What have you wrought? You finally awoken Kyogre, haven't you? What will happen to the world if it, this downpour continues for all eternity? The world's landmass will drown in the deep, dry, deepening sea. What? What? Don't get all high and mighty with me. Well, it's, it, it. Wasn't it you that Team Magma that infuriated Groudon? So long as I have this red orb, I should be able to control Kyogre. I should be able to control it. Says it twice. Really not sure of himself. We don't have the time to argue about it here. Get outside and go see it for yourself. See if you've got you there. See if you've got wrought it. See what you've wrought is the world that we desired. Drenosh, come on. You have to get out of here, to, out of here too. Mm -hmm. Actually, what happened? Why is this wretched scene? I make hor I make a horrible mistake. Made a horrible mistake, not make it. I only want to... Do you understand now, actually? Do you finally realize, see how disastrous... Do you finally see how disastrous the dream turned out to be? We have to hurry. We have to do something before the situation goes completely out of control. Drenosh, don't say anything. I know that I have no right to crit criticize Archie, but the way things are now, I doubt that humans will be capable of doing anything about it. But neither can we stand by and watch, just watch. The responsibility for putting an end to the, this falls to Archie and me. Maxi, this defies belief. Those super ancient Pokemon, their power is, un power is unbelievable. They've upset the balance of nature. Oh no shit. Well done. Clever guys. Stephen, what happened, Josh? This is terrible. After the scorched heat wave ended, the deluge began. If it doesn't stop, all of Hoenn will... No, the whole world will drown. This huge rain cloud is spreading from the above Sutopolis. What in the world can take place there? No, there's no point arguing here. Sutopolis might have provi might provide answers. Drenosh, I don't know what you intend to do, but don't you do anything reckless. Okay, I'm going to Sutopolis. And guys, we are back here. I honestly think that's probably going to do us for today. Um, I need to one remember where the hell Sutopolis entrance is because I'm quite sure I'm missing it by an absolute country mile. And uh, yeah, I've got to start on my team. I think I am probably going to let myself grind up to level 65 as his ace was 75, so it'll still be a massive deficit. But the point is, we barely made it through that, and that was literally by stalling strategies, which I'm sure is no fun to watch. So, without further ado, until next time, I'll see ya.